Howdy folks, and welcome to Thinking with Time Machine. Now, this is, as far as I know, actually just a Portal 2 mod. The video looks kind of... Yeah, the resolution looks really off. Give me one second, I'm gonna be right back after I fix that. Alright, there we go, that's much nicer. So, uh, let's, um... I haven't played this before, so we will just start up a new game. Now, as near as I know, this is just a Portal 2 mod. I say just, it actually looks really well done, but it is its own independent game on Steam. I don't really know what that means as far as, you know, what they consider a game and what they don't consider a game, but ooh. Ooh. Now, for those wondering, I have beaten Portal 2. Uh, I love it. I love it a lot. <laughs> but I don't want to spoil anything. So... Uh, no... Actually, you know what? There's... Oh, wow. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Not the walls! What did you do, you crazy bird? Oh boy. Oh, my cube! The ground! Everything! Oh dear. This this doesn't feel... I'm just gonna turn up the sensitivity a little bit. Um, it doesn't... Yeah, it feels like way too low. I'll put it, put it there. There, that feels... That feels a lot better. Alright, um... Well... Shoot. I can't tell if these texture pops are part of... Ah. Uh, part of what the, the little glitch thingy there, or if they're accidental. I'm going to go with accidental. Everything looks... I'm going to say ground up E. Like, it looks like it's based off of Portal... But that, that doesn't look quite like the Portal 2 one. Like, it looks a little more, um... I'm going to say rough, like someone else... You know, like someone copied the model, but they did their own texture or something. Uh, which is, actually, that's kind of promising, because that means that someone may have put, like, a, a lot of work into building this from the ground up to make sure everything fit together nicely. As opposed to just adding some stuff in there and hoping it works. Ooh. Ooh. Alright, there's a lot of elevatoring going on. A lot of elevatoring. Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, I got my portal gun and this thing. Uh, I'll stand here. What's that? Okay, well, I'll stand here and then I'll get off. I I don't actually know how to use the time machine yet. Um, hmm. Okay, I don't know. Oh boy, controls. Controls for the for the time machine. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Um Okay. I think I pushed I pushed a button at some point. And oh, I pushed R. What did R do? Uh, I'm so confused. Okay, we're gonna look at this. Alright. Portal 2, thinking with time machine. Aperture Laboratories. There's our test chamber. There's the button. There's me. R. Press R. Stand on the button. Press... F. Okay, hold on. R. Stand on the button. I think he pressed R again. And then press F. Oh. Oh. F. There we go. Cool. I think I got it. Um, I have a rough idea of what I did anyway. Oh, this chest chamber is not very far away. Oh. Very bright. Okay, let's see. R... I ah, th there's a button there that I can't see. I gotta watch it again. 
I'm going to pay close attention. R. Q. I think that might be Q. Okay. R. Q. F. Okay, R. Q. Can't I? I thought it could jump on me. Okay, hold on. Do I have to crouch or something? Hmm. R. I'll look down. Because I look down. Q. F. Oh, that's... I'm creepy looking. Hmm. Oh boy, I feel like a... Okay, D, Z, X. I just cannot remember if there's a crouch key. That's that's the only thing I'm thinking of. It's not shift, tab... Uh, oh, 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 there we go. Control. Okay, I think that might be it. Um, control. R... We'll sit here for a little bit. I'll look down. Uh, Q. <laughs> I don't know about you guys. I'm having a ball whale of a time. Okay. Oh, I'm standing. Oh, I, I can't do that. Oh. What the heck? R. Control. Up. Control. Up. Control. Up. Q. Uh, I'm going to stop announcing what I'm doing. Okay, control. Up. Oh, I did it. I did it. I did it, guys. There we go. And get there. There we go. So it's got like a little bit of motion. It's like a little miniature faith plate that I can create myself. Wowzers. Um, instructor push button. I think that's E. Oh, oh, it's making a cube for me. Alright. I'll put it in here. What? What? Did I die? Oh, I, d I didn't even see it. I walked right back in there. Okay, so definitely, definitely time machine shenanigans going on here. Um, R. We'll push the button. We'll grab the cube. And we'll put it here. Q. Okay, um... Oh, it's on a timer. Okay. Um, I don't quite know what to do there. Okay, I'll just say uh, I'll, I'll let it go. There we go. Do stuff for me. Oh, this is really cool. I get to. It's like multiplayer, but with yourself. That's such. That's almost kind of sad. Okay, so I definitely need two of them. But is there a way that I can just get two cubes? I'll put this on this square. Okay, because I don't know if. I, I just want to see if this will disappear. No, it will not. Okay, so I'm going to record this action. Record. E. Oh no, it destroys my cube. But I need two cubes. Oh boy. What? One of them wasn't round, was it? Oh, this one is. Oh my gosh, I feel so silly now. Record the action. Here we go. I'm sorry, guys. Someone was probably yelling at me there. Oh, man. I'm, I'm having a ball of a time with this. Oh, no. Get in. 
understand. Great, so the door is open. And finish my action. And do my action. Great, this is kind of neat. It's actually really, I'm, I'm actually very, very pleased with this. Alright. <laughs> oh, and this was, this was, you know what, if you've got Portal 2 on Steam, this was free. I mean, I'm like, I'm like, demo chambers in, and I'm having a whale of a time. Oh, that's cool. Okay, let's see. Uh -huh, um. Alright, so... Blue goes there. Oh, I guess what I gotta do... Record the action of shooting an orange portal. I'll just stand here for a little bit. There we go. So I've got, uh, I've got that remembered. Does that do anything to it? Let's see. F. Oh, sweet. Cool. Oh, no! I have to, um... I have to record the action of shooting the blue portal, because I need to be on that side. Okay. That's, that's good enough for me. Uh, orange portal. Orange portal. Do the action. Oh! Oh, didn't you record my thingy? I'll record a new one. Record. Quit. Uh, record. Shooting the blue portal. Or actually, no. Uh, oh boy. Record. Shooting the blue portal here. I have to wait for a second. And then I'll shoot the blue portal here. And then I will wait another couple of seconds. Okay. That's good. Go. My clone is going. What? No. No. You, um... Don't we have our own linked set of portals? Are they... We each get an independent set of portals. Oh, that is so cool, but I did not know that. Um, okay. Man, I am doing this so many times. Okay. R. One there. One there. And now we just uh, chill out down here. That is exactly what we do. Just wait here for a second. Good. Go. One there for me. One there for me. Other one there for me. Oh, so many portals. I am so happy with this. I am ecstatic. What I thought I had to do was get a portal, go through it, like, um, like right close to the emitter, and then walk through it where Chell was. I didn't realize we got our own each... We each got our own independent set of portals. Oh, wow. Okay, what have we got here? We've got a button. That'll make me a cube. Um, oh, and it chucks it up in the air. Okay, I'll grab it. I'll put it here. And then I will crouch here is what I think I need to do. Oh, look at that. Is there any portalable surfaces up there? It's really bright. I'm going to turn down this brightness a little bit. Uh, dum -dum -dum -dum. brightness, put it, put it there. Back, back, return to game. There, there, that doesn't hurt my eyes as much. Hopefully it doesn't hurt your eyes as much either. Okay, so I'm going to start recording my action of pushing the button, making the cube, putting this here, standing here and crouching for a second, up, crouch, up, and then going over onto this button, which should let me do that whole thing there. Okay, so finish the recording, uh, F to reenact it. There you go. Go past me. 
Okay, put that down. Get over here. Let me jump on your back. I'm up. And then go stand on that button. Awesome. Cool. Super duper cool. Okay. Um, I'm going to put one portal here and one portal down there. Because I think that I need this cube. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to put this down here for a second to see what I need. Because I don't know what that is going to do. Uh, throw it. It didn't work. Okay, whatever. I just realized that I can use my portals to get back up there. Ooh. Oh, light beam. Okay, that's... That one's not all that complicated. I might have missed something in that puzzle. <laughs> but, you know what? Nope, I'm just going to take it. I'm smart. I'm, uh, I'm a smarty pants. Give me one second. I'm actually just going to check up on the recording time. I don't really know how long I've been playing this. Alright, we got some tunes. So, uh, I think I'm going to go for another ten minutes here, or at least try to get out of... Oh. I was going to say get out of the basic tutorial levels, but I think I've done that. Alright, push the aperture button. Oh, I got a gramophone. Can I get another gramophone? What's happening? What's happening? Oh boy. It's a ship. It's a friendly face plate. Yay! Yay! Can I... Oh, I get it! I get it! I get it! Um, Record. Wait. Wait, where's my science tablet? My... my time machine. Where's... Come on. Where's my time machine? I lost it. Where... where'd it go? Got it back. Hmm... Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Any portalable surfaces? Oh, what about? I could make a portal onto that. What about? What about there? Any anywhere up there? Make a portal. Oh! Oh, look at this. Oh, it's you. Uh oh. What's up? Oh, it is totally. <laughs> I'm. That was by accident. I'm not gonna play with you anymore. Okay, so. Uh, I think it's the two multiplayer robot Peabody and Atlas. Okay. Um, let's see. Okay. What happened? What will become of us? Hmm. Where are you guys? Okay. Oh, I can. I could totally have made a portal on that wall before. Hey, you two. Help me. Help me. Nope, they're not going to help me. Alright, I will, uh... Can I get in this way? Come on. Come on, guys. Help me out. I feel like I'm missing something super obvious. Like, this shouldn't be a puzzle. Arg. Can I just... I'm going to be so mad if I can just walk through this door. Ah! Uh, hey, where'd you go? Robots. I saw you. Paper? Very bright paper. Um, I do feel like I need to do something with that. No? Is there anything? Come on. Oh! What's this? Keyboard's doing something. Oh, they've climbed up onto... 
GLaDOS. And what's what's up? What's up? Hey. Hey. Oh golly. Oh Jiminy. Oh Jiminy. Okay, let's see. Um maybe there's something maybe I can go back and actually finish the test now. Do oh wait, I probably have to grab a new time machine from that room. Um I didn't see one, but I hope there is one. I'm very glad this has a story. I'm really excited to learn, you know, what someone's take on this was. Is there a time machine in here? Time machine? Oh, GLaDOS, SOS. Find time machine back to January 20th, 2021 at just about midnight. Um, okay. Something happened. Oh, the vent is... Oh, it's controlling the test chamber. Okay. Okay, so the vent is back on so I can get something that's not a gramophone and hopefully uh, hopefully use it there. I've always wondered what the purpose of all those things are. Is it like solar power or does GLaDOS emit radiation or whatever? Thanks for helping me out, gramophone, but your your purpose has... Uh, it's It's done now. Is the oh my gosh. Uh okay, I'll be back in a second because I don't want you guys to have to watch that again. There we go. Whee! And we're off to the next test chamber and I think that is where I will call it to the end of the episode here. Um, you know, since this is a new series, let me know what you think, because, you know, brand new to me. I'm having a lot of fun with this, though. Uh, still trying to think of interesting things to say. I mean, uh, you could tell some stories. Tell you about that one time I went camping. Actually, you know what? I, I wasn't really going to tell a story. But now, now I want to. Oh, oh, I've got my time machine back. Lovely. So, um, this one time I was camping, and as some of you know... I live in Canada, and we we have some uh, pretty pretty cool wilderness around here. So what had happened is I was going camping, and it was a pretty commercialized you know campsite. It was a real campsite. We didn't just go out into the bush or whatever. Oh, okay, that was unfortunate. Uh, we didn't just go out into the bush somewhere. We'd actually gone to a campsite. We had a fire and everything. So. I was pretty young. I'd never seen the movie The Blair Witch Project at this point, but my dad had, and you, you know you tell spooky stories around a campfire? Well, he just told us The Blair Witch Project, but none of us had seen The Blair Witch Project, so we all thought that he was just a really good storyteller. So what, what comes of all of this is um, my cousin and I decide to play some uh, flashlight tag later put that there decide to play some flashlight tag and we had a had, had a real tough time you know thinking of a we, we were playing flashlight tag gosh I got lost in my story and there there were about four of us playing and so my cousin and I we were hiding together and what we decided or we didn't decide to do anything we we're just sitting there and we said hey you remember, you remember that story that my dad told? And we just got up and instantly ran as fast as we could back to the campsite. We scared ourselves so thoroughly. Like, we... There was, a uh, No coming back from that. Ooh! Perfect. Ow. Alright. Get over there. And, um... New... New me rec recorded done recording and get in there there you go lovely and that worked perfect I think that was the most roundabout way to do that ever but uh, I hope you enjoyed my campfire story and I hope you enjoyed this episode of thinking with time machine uh, you know if you had a good time don't forget to like favorite and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video, provided I don't get a bunch of a uh, bunch of hate mail. Send me fan mail. Fan mail's cool. Makes my day. And this is Monsieur Pandora.
signing out of Aperture Laboratories. Bye-bye.